In this video, I'm going to show you how to view the high res imagery that comes with PFS covering your farm. Here we're looking at our demonstration property. The buttons on the right hand side are labeled view high resolution imagery allows us to select the image we want to see. By clicking on the button, the screen changed and a list of available imagery dates covering your farm is displayed. For this demonstration, we're going to open the imagery for the 9th of August 2015. The, the dates are listed in latest first, oldest last, and for each entry we can see the date of capture and the amount of cloud cover as a percentage. We click on the date and click apply and wait for the imagery to load. Once the imagery has finished opening up, a number of layers are available for you and these are displayed in the layer box in the top right hand corner of the map. The button representing the currently selected layer is colored light green and has a transparency slot enabled as well. To select another layer type, simply click on its name. Here we're going to select the NDVI image. Please wait a few moments for it to load. The NDVI image, also called a greenness image, shows the relative greenness of vegetation in the image area. The range of colors, see the legend in the bottom left hand corner, ranges from reds, oranges and yellows for those very dry areas and the blues and purples are the very lush and green areas. Let us zoom in on an area just above the bottom and to the right. Here we can see some bluish areas surrounded by green. These bluish areas are areas of more green and maybe areas of con concern. If we use the slider, we can change the opacity of the layer to see what might be causing these slightly lusher areas. If this sort of thing shows up in one of your paddocks, then it could represent a different vegetation type, such as weeds being present. If we saw areas of dryness, it could represent areas of your paddock that are suffering from water penetration issues. We can see that using this high-res imagery, you can see changes happening in your paddock that may not be visible from the ground. To view imagery for another date, simply click on the light yellow button and select a new date. To go back to the main map, simply click on the button labeled Paddock Data and Low-Res Imagery. Thank you.